I don't know how well you can see down there, but there's a squirrel that has fallen down this pipe. Buddy, my dog, alerted to me to this. This isn't my pipe, but this is one of the problems with these pipes that come up like this. They need to have caps because otherwise wildlife can fall down there. I'm going to try to rescue Mr. Squirrel. Okay. I got Mr. Squirrel out of there. I used this reach tool here. Poor baby. He's, who knows how long he was in there. And he's obviously wounded. So what I'm going to do is uh, wrap him up in this towel and warm him up and help him out. Okay, here he is. He or she. You can see that he's breathing. But I don't know if he's breathing. I'm going to leave him in the truck with the doors shut. So that, and with this towel, so that he can recuperate without having a predator get him in the night. And I'll see in the morning if he's alive or not. He got, his, his, yeah, you got your claw stuck there. I don't know if he has internal injuries or if he was just so cold and hungry and stuff. He doesn't know what's going on. Sissy loves you. I'm your sissy. Hey, he's starting to perk up some. I'll leave him in the truck. I'll get him sorted so that he's in the truck safely. Okay, I've returned with a saucer full of water and a bowl full of sunflower seeds and bird seed because I don't have any nuts. He's still alive. He's breathing. I'm sure I'm making him nervous. I pray the dear good Lord heals you. He can if he wants to. But if he takes you on to heaven, you can be with Uncle Roy. Uncle Roy loves wildlife. You can hang out at Uncle Roy's place. Which will be Sissy's place when it's my turn, too. We'll be together and we'll be with you if the Lord takes you tonight. Hopefully he won't, though. But I'm going to have to find, you know, that's not my property down there, but I'm going to have to find something to cover up all these, these pipe holes. I rescued a skunk maybe 10 years ago from another pipe hole next door at the hers cabin. Jesus says that all the hairs on your head are counted and that his father sees all any sparrow that falls his father knows about. In other words, God is very concerned about animals. So let's hope that God's going to heal you. But if the way he does it is by bringing you to heaven, we'll find out. At least... You're here where you're going to be safe from predators, and you're going to be in this towel. You have food and water down there. If you perk up later, you'll find you've got a couple of little seeds there. Sissy loves you, sweet squirrel. Well, I came back to bring a a fuzzy thing, and he's he's moving around more. But then he gets scared when I'm here. I put those little sunflower things there. I don't know if he's going to survive the night or not. This is your mama's. I'm your sister. This is my mother's. <laughs> I don't care for the pattern, but it's a nice fuzzy sleep pants. Mother's fuzzy sleep pants, one of her sleep pants, and this will keep you warm in the truck. Do you want some water? I have a saucer of water here. Here, let me dip my finger and I don't know if that helps. You seem to have goo on your mouth. See, I don't know if you're if you have internal injuries. I don't know if you have internal injuries. 
but I do know you're getting more and more feisty. I don't know how long you were in that big pipe. Here's mother's sleep pants to help keep you warm. Don't try to escape. Now you're covered up. Oh, let's see. You want some seeds here? I'll just put those down there. I don't know what this means. You're breathing. You're breathing. Now, why don't you just rest for the night, hmm? And hopefully the Lord will heal you. Either that or you pass away, but at least you know you passed away warm with sleep pants on you and loved. I wish I knew more what to do. I don't, don't know what else to do. It's not like we have squirrel rescue around here. Even the vet's office is closed. Sissy loves you, and let's hope that you do well in the night. Bye-bye.